This is Anita again, and this is um, another vintage journal that I've made for a friend of mine. So again, I've made a little cover like I usually do. Um, this is the front. Um, this is photo board, photo mount board. So it's quite thick, very durable. Um, I've used that for the label and also for the cover. The cover's also got photo corners, lace on the spine, some little charms, angel wings, uh, lucky four leaf clover, some beads and a key there which I've put some PBO in. So it's just uh, quite a nice gold and pinky colour inside there. Some nice lace. Um, the closure is just some eyelets and some ribbon. Let me go in. Got her initials there. Um, this just has some. Ah, oh, this is just a little note to say. It says this is your journal. Please do not be afraid to use your journal. It is a place where you can make a record of your thoughts, your dreams, your wishes. You can stick photos, tickets, drawings, poems or recipes in your journal. You can draw, scribble or stamp in it. What you must not do with your journal is leave it in a drawer where it will be forgotten and not used. The maker hopes that you will fill this little book with all of your precious memories and pass this on to someone special one day. Please enjoy your journal. It was handmade with love by Anita. So that's in there. And then this, uh, I've done exactly the same in my sister-in-law's um, journal. That's like a little grid and it says my year in pixels. And you basically have to colour in each square um, as to how you're feeling, so happy, sad, anxious, excited, angry, bored, tired, all has a different colour and you colour in your little square. So that's there. And we've got little tuck spots, uh, all the papers are tea dyed. Um, the tags here have been used with my Sizzix, Tim Holtz Sizzix die set. Um, this is Crafters Workshop um, stenciling all the way with a Rangers pink um, archival link. These are made, another little tuck spot. It's a little uh, pocket there which I've sewn and that's just some plain tea dyed paper. These are Tim Holtz flower dyes little flip up, some more sewing, that as you've seen in my other journals that I've done is like a photo frame which I've seen Johanna Clough do, that's a little Tim Holtz rub on more sewing, some little peel-offs, more plain tea dyed paper, it's the other side of the bag. This is uh, Tim Holtz tissue paper, some stamping. There's remember. Some library tickets. Music paper. I've punched all the corners with a Martha Stewart punch. Tag. Just a little glassine envelope. There's favourite things. This is a Tim Holtz stencil, which I've used some um, distress stain. It's more plain paper. I'll do that in a minute. It says love this. It's 
it's uh, Tim Holtz tissue paper, just for journaling on the back of. The tag. It's a uh, Tim Holtz rub on. Little tuck spot. And these little envelopes ordered from Amazon. And they're all really cute. Just covering up the brad. Tag. It says vintage. It says wish list. That's a uh, Sizzix. Probably, I think it might be a Tim Holtz um, embossing folder for the Sizzix. Dilusions spray, really pretty, and that's uh, on that tag. It's um, uh, embossing folder again. Sort of picked up all the bumps, and, that. and that's another Sizzix embossing folder. That's another Tim Holtz one. Um, again, envelope which covers my centre signature. You can't see the tying. Another little envelope. I think most of the envelopes I've just put a little bit of paper in just for journaling. stuff. Photos. That goes in the top I think. Is it on the side? I can't remember now. No it does go in the top. It's in there on either side. Tags, tickets. This is um, sticky fabric I got from Tiger. Some peel offs. Flip out some journaling. Spot behind and in the bag. It's another rub on Tim Holtz and here. Bag. That's a little private message in there which I've sealed down with wax. I'll leave that for my friend to find. I'm not going to tell her about it, it might take weeks, days, years for her to discover. Um, there's a little note in there anyway. A little journaling card. Another photo spot. It says a beautiful world. That was uh, Tim Holtz rub on. It's a sweet and love. Just a little card in there. It's the other side of the envelope. It says for the record. Can you see that? It won't focus. Typical. It says memory. Tags, and tags, just plain paper. And then this little thing at the back with some more plain paper in. This came in a, an iPad 
box, just an apple thing. I've glued it in the back. And this is uh, wallpaper. And it was a sample from home base again. So that's that. Um, please like, subscribe, comment. I'm always happy to get comments, good or bad, critical. If you've got any questions you'd like to ask me, um, go for it. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.